Happy Father's Day. Hey, May Bays. I just wanted to give a shout out to all of the fathers out there. I want you guys to take a load off and enjoy your Father's Day. Now, first and foremost, right now, it's a little informal in terms of how I'm doing it. Me and my husband probably gonna go out and grab something to eat and then head back in the house. Um, I just wanna say that to all the fathers, the guys that are standing in the gap, the guys that are going forth effort to do what's best and do what's right for their families. Kudos to you. And the men and the the guys that are um, not doing so well in that department, you know, it's, you can always keep trying. There's no point to give up. You have, you have children out here, you have family out here, get out and reach out to them and do all that you can to be in their lives and be supportive um, because a family nucleus needs a father figure. So we always salute all the guys that are putting forth effort. We thank, we thank all of the gentlemen that have the sense and the wisdom and the strength and fortitude to be men in their families and to be the heads of their households. It's, it's a blessing. It's definitely a blessing. Um, and when you have a legacy that you have to leave behind, such as your children and your assets and whatever else that you put together, you want to make sure that it rings through generations. But even if it didn't ring through generations, the fact that you made an impact on a generation and a positive impact on a, a, a generation. So we salute you guys. Happy Father's Day to you. We salute you guys and we um, commend you guys for doing all that you do for your for your wives, your spouses, your children, your parents. And um, again, like I said, it's, it gets no better than a day like this. Mother's Day had its day. Now it's Father's Day. We all want to commend you fathers over and over again. Right now, today is the day we love up on them. We show them our support as we do every day, but just giving them extra, an extra abundance of love. And um, one thing I will say for all the um, young ladies that's out there that um, are fatherless, young boys that's out there that's fatherless, keep in mind that no matter what the circumstances are, I can't believe that any parent um, don't care about their children. There's always circumstantial uh, things that happen and issues that happen that will come into play as to why they're not in your lives. Now, I'm not saying that that's an excuse, but what I want to impart to you guys is that God always gives you someone. God always put a ram in the bush there for you. You have to be on the lookout. There's always a blessing along the way okay and sometimes you don't always get your guidance from the biological parental heirs right then and there you you might have to you might have a cousin or aunt, uncle or grandparents or even friends or even uh, uh parents that uh you get through foster care you know or even just friends you not all people don't always come up in the same situation and that's what makes us unique, that we're all not the same, that we all have different backgrounds, that we all have different upbringings. That's what makes us unique, and we learn from each other, right? So I would always say and encourage all of those children that's out there, that's fatherless, that you're extra special because you've done it with one parent where one other child had two, okay? So you got through, and you got through. And that's all any parent wants is their child to be safe, their child to have uh, a decent upbringing. Um, they, they are um, level-headed. 
y'all they shooting fireworks around here so you know it's you know what can i say where i live in? <laughs> but uh yeah that gets it in early so that's what i was saying but when you have when you have children out here that are raised in a single a single household i grew up without my father on the scene i mean he was he was around but he was i was not living with him and um he was kind of like an absent parent but i'm being real he was but i knew he loved me and kids that's all they really want all children want is to know that they are loved from their parents so i would always say to every young child out there happy father's day i would always say to a child any any children any children out there to you know respect your parents honor your parents and for the ones that have their fathers you're blessed for the ones who do not have their fathers you're still blessed okay and if you don't have a father you got a father for a few minutes this 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 is the father Absolutely. of all fathers <laughs> she decides He's a girl dad. We got all girls, y'all. And so, you know, right now we're going to bless him with some food, some nourishment. And we're going to take a break from the girls for a second and just love up on him. So happy Father's Day, baby. Mm -hmm. Trying to forget about, uh, about the 1738. Really? No. <laughs> No way. <laughs> Always gotta do something. Where I gotta edit something out. It never fails. It never fails. Get in the car. Get in the car. Okay, you neighbors. It's been real. I just wanted to say that. Happy Father's Day to all my fathers out there.